This week we're getting coached up by the man, Rashard Smith. Hey, we want to know about punt returns. Rashard's our guy, and Rashard, as a tight end, I knew how to catch a pass. Mm -hmm. You've caught passes. What's the biggest difference between catching passes and catching punt returns? I mean, it's really no, it's really no big difference. I mean, as both of them, you got to be able to concentrate. You got to see the ball. You got to know the defender's at. So, I mean, it's about the same thing, catching punts and catching passes. When you're running routes, though, I kind of know where the defenders are. The only problem with catching a punt, you're looking up. How do you know where those guys are? It, 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 it takes practice, you know, when you got to see the ball out the punter's foot, and when the ball reaches its highest point, you got to be able to have time to look down and see where the defender's at and get your eyes back up at the ball. And, of course, it's just raw speed after that. After that, I mean, it's, it's talent, it's raw speed and talent. We're going to do a couple. We're going to call this punt returning one-on-one -on -one right here. When the punt returner kicks the ball, you have to get up under the ball and get square. Okay. And you have to clamp your arms. So you got to have your arms like this so the ball can fall into a pocket. That way you can secure the catch and you can tuck the ball also. Locate it, find the defenders, and catch and run. Okay, when you talk about locating the defenders, now we are both talking about the same thing, a guy coming to light you up, right? Mm -hmm. We're talking about that guy. Yeah. Doesn't that, you know, make you a little bit nervous when you're trying to catch the punt? Um, it don't make me as more nervous as, you know, returning kickoffs as a guy coming full speed, because in the punt return scheme, you know, it's, it's always going to be 11 on 11. So it's always going to be one guy that's left unblocked, and that's the guy I have to beat. So coach tell us during the game plan which guy is going to be unblocked. And I'd have to know in my head where that guy is and how far he is from me. So I have to, when I catch the ball, if I don't fair catch it, I have to defeat that guy because he's my blocker. I have to block him. So I have to make him miss and depend on the other team to make their blocks. All right. Well, let me, let me give this a shot. Now, talk me through what I'm looking okay. for here. We're going to give you a shot right here. Uh, it's the really wind, simple. The wind, I don't have a lot of wind. How much does the wind affect this punt? Um, I mean, the wind, the wind plays a big factor. Every time we come out, every time I come out, I pick up a piece of, I pick up a, some blade of grass, and I just toss it in the air. So that the wind will tell me which way the ball is going. If, if the wind is behind the punter, they have to back up a little deeper. Okay. If the, if the blade of grass go that way, just slide up. Okay. Just depending on where the wind's blowing. All right, fantastic. I'm, I'm cupping my hands like this. I'm used to catching passes like mm -hmm. this, but you don't want that. You want it like you, this. You have to catch the punt like this, and you have to get square up under the ball. Get square up under the so ball. So if, if, like, if the nose of the ball is pointing up, that means the ball is going to drop. It's okay. going to die in the air. If the nose of the ball is coming down, it's, the ball is going to travel. Okay. All right, here we go. All right, nose of the ball is up, is up, up is up. It's up. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You want to you catch it? Yeah. You catch it? You want to catch it? I don't know. So that way you want to you catch it square, but also like coming forward a little bit. So if like if you catch it like this, you're losing ground. But I mean, it's not a bad thing because the most important thing is securing, securing the ball and having the position for the offense. So basically what I want to do is I want to time it up like an outfielder, catching it as I'm moving forward. Mm -hmm. All right, Nose all right. The ball. Yeah. There you go, there. Oh. That's it right now. Oh. That's it right now. All right. <laughs>